Monday morning feels like a great day to get some important errands done, like maybe get your driver's license. Oh, except you can't. There's no line here because it's closed for a state holiday that apparently no one knows about. Car after car pulled into the driver's license office on Monday only to drive away again. That triumphant feeling of having the responsibility to show up early to get your driver's license, only to be squished by a sign that doesn't even specify which holiday the office is closed for. And for everyone we spoke to, it was a surprise. Confederate Memorial Day. Yeah, it wasn't on the calendar. I had no clue today was a holiday. <laughs> I mean, there's, you know, as I'm a veteran, but still, I'm, you know. Uh, this is kind of a surprise to me that they're closed on a supposed holiday I've never heard of. Throws off my whole staff. I got to switch it up today, man. Cramping some people's style. Yeah, it, it's, my, it's bad for me. You don't yeah. usually put that like on a calendar or something? I appreciate your sacrifice, but, I, I, you know, I'm living today, dealing with today's issues. And the overall greatest frustration was certainly with how special arrangements had to be made to be here this morning, only for it to be closed. A day's work and I gotta go probably do a second day now. Today was a special day to take off work and, you know, lose pay and... That's why I see the messed up now, for real, because stuff like this. The holiday affects offices on the state level, but banks, post offices, and even liquor stores are open. ABC stores will be open today, so you can buy alcohol sold by the state, but you can't get a license. That's probably where, where everybody's going to end up when they find this out. Don't forget to mark Confederate Memorial Day down in your calendar for next year. In Huntsville, I'm Christine Mitchell, WHNT News 19.